Right, it's something like the 3rd of April and I've come back to the River Parrot starting from Paul at this time and working my way round those two loops that I was talking about the other day. This is a bit like deja vu. I'm starting at Paul at Church, St John the Baptist, but the video I did last year was the other side of the church, so I thought I'd just to vary it a bit, I'd do the video from this side. It's got a nice gold cockerel on the top for the wind vane. There's the en entrance down there to the vicarage, plus you can also get um, the key from there if you really want to get inside the church. Apparently they do have a key if they're in. Little walled garden there. And then over there, I'll be walking all over there in a minute and looking back at the church. So I had to have a bit of a couple of days recovery after my last walk, not because of the walk. I wore boots without hill supports. Just zooming on the weather vane. It's a lovely, pretty weather vane. Nice gold cockerel on the top there, look. And it's quite breezy today again. Yesterday would have been a perfect day. But my calves and feet were really hurting because I wore Wellington boots without heel support which was nearly as bad as me doing that walk without any footwear on. I'd, what I'd done, I'd forgotten, I'd taken the hill supports out to put in um, a pair of trainers. I just didn't think of it. So basically, I don't expect it's open, I'll just check. Sometimes they have the little doors open. No. It's because of thieving. So this is the start of um, April's walk and I was here almost exactly a year ago, not exactly but a couple of days, only by a couple of days and uh, I came here a few times because I, I found graves of um, people that are somehow connected in a very long and weird way on the tree. Um, through somebody else's marriage but not exactly to me that directly or anything like that it's just I found these graves and I um, to do with the hollies and that I think it was I did a bit of, little bit of dig hunting for graves for them uh, there's a big family of them all over there and I also went to um, Puritan church and found some more so this is a lovely day. It's a bit breezy. I think it'll be okay though. I'm looking forward to it. I wanted to do it yesterday, but I didn't. I know that I would have damaged myself. You have to be sensible when you're doing walking. You know the difference between being tired and on the, the verge of an injury if you don't rest. Rest is very important. So lo I love this church. This church is like a beacon to the people on the River Parrot. It's white and bright and looks very nice from the distance as well. And it's very lovely inside. I've only ever been in once and I was videoing when there was something going on. It was very difficult. They were very friendly. They are very friendly here. Right, so basically, like last year, I'm going to go through that gate, I'm going down onto a little track, and I'm going down towards the River Parrot. So that's what I'm going to do now on this part of the video. It's almost deja vu.